What's up? Easy Overdose here. So I reformatted the other day and you know fresh install and everything. Tweaking all the settings, getting everything, preferences right and stuff like that. And go to make my first video. Now keep in mind I've used this program, Cyberlink Power Director 11, for a, almost a full year and for the most part probably nine months plus I've used this profile H264 profile uh, or codec I'm sorry with this profile the 1080p 60 frames per second high bitrate profile and I've never had an issue with it it's always worked well today post format it does not work it says production unsuccessful blah 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 update your graphics card driver blah 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 make sure you have the latest version of Windows Media Player or QuickTime software blah 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 or you can create a shittier quality video in a different format so what's ironic about this is my video card driver is newer than it's ever been because like I, did, I don't update that shit very often as long as it works I leave it alone if it ain't broke don't fix it type shit and I uh, always turn auto updates off on everything alright so that is bullshit right there and then it says latest version of Windows Media Player or QuickTime I had Windows Media Player 11 now I have 12 okay so it's newer and then QuickTime I don't know it's it's newer though I got the new shit so like I don't know what's broke with this thing now but it's some bullshit luckily I found a workaround the workaround is you just click a new profile and whatever profile you're highlighted on it will it'll have all the settings like preset for that profile so this is an exact clone of that profile so you just click OK and what you'll get is custom profile like this now what I have did on this one is I went ahead and just tweaked the frame rate instead of letting it encode at 60 frames per second even though for the most part I record at 30 frames per second uh, especially with the story the story records at 30 frames per second because that's what I have it set to for apps will record I think like variable frame rate but when you upload to YouTube which is what a lot of people do YouTube will restrict it to 30 frames per second when it like re-encodes it to whatever the YouTube codec is it it's 30 frames per second codec so this is the exact codec uh, minus the frame rate change now I did test this a minute ago with it at the 59 point whatever and it worked the same as it's about to work when I show this to you so now this is this same profile minus the frame rate change and look at that no error you can see down here it's starting the encoding process strange right I don't know it works so whatever I hope this uh, helps somebody Alright, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the tip. Peace.